Welcome back to another video of Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I am so appreciative of the support. Without further ado, let's get to it. You there! What are you doing? I'm just walking, friend. If you wish to have words, come closer. Are you one of Harold's men? I am. The king wishes to make a survey of the land he now rules. Nothing more. Let me ask, are you one of the conquered? Did Harold take your lands as well? No. My family has lived under his banner since the days of his father, Aftan the Black. Well, welcome to Thornburg, warrior. How are you doing, Hytham? You survived a serious blow. I am mending. I will never be the warrior Bassam wishes me to be, but I can serve my brotherhood in many other ways. If Kjotve dead, will you return to the south? We are going west, in fact. Bassam is a tireless crusader. Get some rest before you sit out, then. Injured men do not fare well in the open ocean. Of course. Thank you. Can I interest you in a game of Orlok? It's Eivor! Open the door! Come in, but keep your voice down. You will alert Harald's men. Where will we live? The English will fight back! The wars will never end! Oh, they will... Two days ago... We rid this land of Kjotve and his dogs. Yet today, we do not celebrate. Today we cower under a cloud of fear. But it need not be like this. We are not the heel-trodden subjects of a boy king. We are the Raven Clan. Our destiny is our own. Did you know about your father's oath to Harold? I did not. And for that, my anger burns hotter than any man's here. But I will not let that drive me into despair. We cannot stay in Norway. Not under Harold's boot. Not without fueling more war. So we push forward. To newer lands. To England. And there make a new home. A kingdom of our own. The sons of Ragnar Lothbrok have been in England eight winters already. Is there any land left for a clan of our size? More than enough, wife. Of the four kingdoms of England, only one is truly pacified. I have no desire to wear Harald's leash. I like this idea. A saga for the ages, I agree. It will take time and resources to build ourselves a new home, but the riches taken from Kjotve's raid would suffice. No. That belongs to my father, as a fair compensation. In England, we must start anew. You would start us with nothing, in a land we do not know, among people who hate us? Kjotve's riches would go some way to easing our passage, Sigurd. I bested him. It is within my rights to claim his goods. Our leaving must not be an assault on my father. It is a time of renewal for us. I don't know, like, personally, I think I want to go where we leave the resources. Like, start anew, start fresh. If you object, I understand. Let your father keep Kjotve's riches. England will have riches and cargo enough for us. Good. I did not want this cloud hanging over us. It is a wise leader who considers the need of others. To England then, before the day is out. Pack what you need, but no more than that. And tighten your lips. The last thing we need is the attention of Harald's troops. How much did you hear? Enough. A new path is revealed and your journey will be challenging. 
Will you not join us? For my mother's sake, I cannot. But our threats will cross again before the final day. Until then, farewell. So, uh, based on what is going on, I'm thinking that this is actually the time that we actually go to England. So we're moving from Norway, and we're going to go ahead and head out to England, so just like the Ragnar sons, and uh, Ragnar Rothbrook. Again, I make reference to the Vikings TV show. If you've watched it, you know what I'm talking about. And if you haven't watched that, I strongly recommend that you actually take a look at it. So I think I want to get some of my gear right before it is that I even start this other mission. So let me take a look and see what's going on. How can I help? Do you need anything else? I will free you from this bond. And I will be ready when you need me. Alright, so I think I want to upgrade this. Hopefully I can as well for this. Ah, not enough. Is there anything else I can? Not enough for any of them. Well, let me see what this does. All right, so basically, I have some work to be. I have some work to do as it relates to my gear. I gotta go on the grind. All right, so now to use those two skill points. I want to see what's over here. Hmm. Doesn't actually fit my play style, but let's see what's here. There we go. That's pretty cool. Alright, so the grind is towards that. Alright, so now we've sorted out all of that, I think it's time to go ahead and attempt the mission. Destination England. The good thing about all of this is that any, at any given time at all, we can always come back to Norway. But that's good. Because there are a lot of stuff I'm seeing I that like I haven't gotten it yet, but it for the progression of the story, I'm just going to go ahead and go to England. And then at a later date, we'll just go, go ahead and come the back wind here. Favors us. We should set sail without delay. You made quick work of packing. Well done. The dream of new lands is a powerful lure. As is the promise of glory. But the act of leaving so beloved a home, there's a sadness to it. Having doubts? No, not at all. The die is cast. Then let fate guide our journey. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let us tank to the water and leave unbothered while we have the chance. That chance has passed. Look! Fate flies on swifter wings than we. King Harold's banner. Sigurd, what is this assembly? What are you planning? 
An exit, father. As graceful as I can. For if I cannot be king in the land of my birth, I will start a new saga. In England. Nonsense. Your place is here, son, at my side. There will be other victories soon. Other glories. My choice is made, father. Do not hope otherwise. Steer Bjorn Jarl. Our men were killed as we patrolled nearby. And the word is... Eivor swung the axe. If the dead could speak, what would they say of their deaths, Wolf Kissed? They would tell you how they offered us insults, and how I slew them for it. As the dead cannot defend themselves, a fair geld is wanted. Fifty weight of silver for each life. By law. Fifty weight? You will have it from me. A parent must pay the price of his children's folly. That was generous, Lord. Why England? Why throw away all you have for such an uncertain future? Here you could be a king's hero, Eivor. Your name known all across Harold's many kingdoms. No. I will not be captive to another man's gaudy design. My destiny is my own to weave. Eivor speaks for both of us, father. You gambled your honor and you lost your family. I hope the trade was worth it. Anger and sadness wrestle for my heart, but I am glad you'll leave this place alive. Alright, so this guy's parenting is very questionable. Like, he just turns away and walks off without even looking back as long as you were alive. Like, really. Alright, so this is it. The big adventure. England awaits us. Let me just go ahead and join the ship. Or let me just say join the crew. Apparently the I see that different you seat. Weeping sacks of wool. Put some okay. muscle into those poles. Ration your strength, dog. We have an ocean. Sigurd, what's our course? The songs of Ragnar hey, established hey. a settlement near the coast. We set sail for that. Draghi, sing a song to lift our hood. To rouse the gods! Inspire a mighty fart from Thor to speed us on our way! An ocean lies before us, Eivor. And on its far side, a new kingdom awaits. You know England well from your troubles. I spent a season in their kingdom of Mercia. A temperate land, lush and wild. By now, the sons of Ragnar will have claimed its heart. Do we mean to join their army? They will join ours. In time, all of England will know of Raven Clan and the glory we brought to that fractured land. So to England! Glory and destiny! To England! To England! For Valhalla! Finally, the logo pops. I was wondering where that was. All this time, all these hours, and it's just getting started. It's awesome. Aurora Borealis that never burns away. 
Unfortunately, we are stumped as to why this is happening. And if we cannot find an answer soon, it may change the way we live, the way we communicate, even the way we evolve forever. Dr. Sirka went on to say... Bought you more electrolytes? Oh, new and improved citrus flavor. Thanks, Sean. How do we fix this? How are you the key to everything? Alright, so... I'm guessing that is Eivor. Well, his bones, actually. You're a long way from home, Eivor. Like, mm. I don't know, like, these little cutaways, um, away from the actual game, game. Um, it's never... Did you get my tea? I've never really actually gotten to like it. To be honest. Oof. Mint tea is not actually tea, Bex. It's an infusion. It's really just dirty minty water. I don't care what you call it, Sean. Did you buy any? Of course I did, love. Hey, sorry about pulling you out. The generator was sputtering. That's fine. I needed air. How is the Animus data stream? Comfortable? Felt pretty stable after a while. Good. Just give me a sec, and you can jump back in. Another satellite came down. Did you see? I did. One of Abstergo's. That's good. Well, most of North America just lost its GPS service, so... Depends what you mean by good, really. Right. Even when we win, we lose. Okay, we're all set. Whenever you're ready, you can jump back in. You gonna put this in the fridge, Sean? Of course. In half a minute. Remember, tomatoes go on the counter, not the fridge. Please enjoy your stay. Remember, all the garbage must be packed out, and please water the plants once a day. Yeah, I won't remember that. Feeling okay? Better. But I'm worried that it could happen again. The two data streams. I can't promise it won't. I barely understand it myself. It felt like two minds fighting over one brain. It hurt like a shotgun to the head. Right. There's something about this Viking's DNA sample that feels dense, noisy. Could it be the staff? Interfering somehow? How do you mean? My headaches, my temper. They started the day I got that thing. I hope you're not making excuses for, you know, your friend. Jesus, no. I'm not. Sorry. Just take it easy. And if you feel yourself slipping again, let us know. I'm trying. I really am. Be nice to sleep in a real bed when this is over. Alright, so I really think I want to get back to the main game. Yeah. Let's get to it. Alright, time to go. Norway to England takes about a week by long ship, so I'll scrub ahead. Layla, you okay? Sorry. Can you play the message again? We have the transcript. If you're looking for something, I can no, go and... No, I want to hear it. Okay. I don't mean to be cryptic. It's just... That message led us here. To this place. To a Norse grave in North America. So those bones out there are the only lead we have. Our only chance at fixing this planet before it's too late. Here it is. I lived. I died. And now I sleep. 
and in my sleep I dream. And in my dreams, I see an end to the doom that will grip the earth once again. Find the wolf kissed. Find the mad one. Find me. And save us all from another death. Unsettling, that is. That pulse in the message. Are you sure it's just coordinates? Nothing else? Nothing I can find. Okay, I'm ready. Here we go. Our new home. Not a patch on Norway, but we'll make this land our own soon enough. I'm glad to see any land at all. I will be happy to have my feet on solid ground again. We must not rush our landing. All you see here is Saxon territory. The Kingdom of Mercia, largely unpacified. There will be eyes watching us from the trees, with bows drawn and traps set. We must be wary. Ramvi, dig in your oars! All standing! Have you spotted something? Not yet. Well, let us go ahead to clear the path of any dangers. Then follow our lead when the sun brushes the horizon. Understood! May Thor bless you all on your way! We will see you soon! Sail on! Yes! I'm ready for whatever these green thumbed fairy folk have to throw at us. Sigurd, do the sons of Ragnar know that we're coming? They do not, for they will not scoff at our visit. Of the four kingdoms in England, the sons of Ragnar have settled only one. The rest is ripe for the taking. Do we mean to join their army? No! No! We will speak with them. Get the lay of the land. ...and carve this country into as many pieces as we see fit. Look ahead there! Is that what passes for a town? Plain brick in a single rune to their timid god? That rune is called a root, Doug. The cross upon which their god was sacrificed. It sits atop a monastery, a place of worship. That cross killed their Christ, and now they display it in worship? Bizarre! We carve idols of our gods and make wishes before them, like our sacrifices to Odin, the One-Eyed. But we do not worship the wolf that kills him! That is the difference! Whatever strangeness we see in these Saxons, they must think the same of us. The hammer! Now there is a symbol worthy of a god. A bolt of lightning would take that cross clean off! <laughs> like, no cap, these Viking guys are... Butchering Jesus, like <laughs> that's not nice. That's wild. Look there! What are they doing? Ritual drowning. Baptism, Doc. Are the ways of Christians really so unfamiliar to you? Not at all. I simply forgot. And someone has to keep the conversation up. It must be priests and worshippers alone in that place. We could storm this port with ease. Sack it without breaking a sweat! Is there much in the way of treasure there? Always! They shape precious metals and cut jewels to their gods! There will be a fortune there! Later, Dag! There will be time enough for raiding, once we have settled! Come to! Stop the boats! Pull up over there! The way forward is blocked by a chain spanning the river. We must remove it before passing on. A chain? Can we cut through it? It's too thick for access. But there must be a way to release it somewhere in that camp. I will go. And I will be right behind you. No, Dad. You stay here. Should trouble come our way, I want you defending the ship. A good idea. Send out the arrow and keep your sharpest axe at hand, huh? Something like that. Alright, so I guess I'm the first one to take a step on England's soil. And my first act as a Britishman, I think I should kill a couple of their residents. How does that sound? Sounds it sounds good to me. I must be careful now.
Alright, so I think I'm gonna go high first. In the event that I'm trying to do something down there and he's seeing what I'm doing. That wouldn't be nice. Bye bye, friend. And now, on to the lesser folk. know that this hurts me more than it hurts you. <laughs> I'm just kidding, no, it hurts you more. Oh, it's gonna hurt him too. Oh my gosh. Alright, now to take a couple things and then go ahead and get the objective out the way. So those red things, those red glowing things. Ooh, loot. What? No. Put it down. River chain blockade. Alright, so... This chain is huge. Pull the anchor to the piers. I might try to get everything before. I go ahead and complete this. Let's see what's left around the place. Alright. I think that is it. Give those dogs a good knock around and take whatever treasures they have. Easy pickings. Not today, Dad. We press on until we reach our goal. We cannot afford another surprise. Now be on your guard. It should not be far. Gods, I'm ravenous. I hope they have food and ale on hand when we arrive. We should have sent word ahead of us, Sigurd, to get something on the spit. If Havdan, Uba, and Eva Ragnarsson are lacking food in England, then all of us will starve. Have no worry. Ah, I can see it now. A suckling pig tender and juicy. And the ale as gold as the treasures that we failed to steal back there. A man of simple pleasures, aren't you, Dag? And he is happier for it. For my part, I look forward to standing in the footsteps of the giants that built this land. What giants? The great Romans and their empire. Giants of a forgotten age. They held dominion here long ago, and their ruins dot the landscape. Every brick and stone tells a story of conquest and glory, and now they are rubble and ash. Ready to be remade. We will rebuild their empire brick by brick. Now it will not crumble to dust. All things end, God. The ruins are not worn. They are tested. Look then, just ahead. Will the sons of Ragnar make their camp? Last! We find our feet on steady ground. Sigurd, hold back. Something is wrong. Good eye. There's too little movement for an army. Only tents and a few men. Not the army we hope to find. No. Let us get a closer look. Alright, so this is gonna be your first stop in England. I'm not sure what's gonna happen, but let's let's see what's what's up. Like off topic. No joke, do you see 
the scenery. Do you see the trees on the colors? Those are not Norsemen. They're too ragged and soiled. We should proceed on foot, lest they spot the boats. Dag and I will go together. We all go. If they are friends, I wish to meet them as a yard. And if they are foes, then we fight them all together. Who are these men? They speak with twisted accents. English, no doubt. Dark Eivor! On me! A mess of filthy Danes befouling our riverways. You there. Give us your name. I am Sigurd Jarl of Fornberg. And you are... Men who do not take kindly to Dane invaders creeping into our camp. You'd best move along, pagan. Spare yourselves a slaughter. You threaten those men with a play of swords and expect us to cower? I have been eight days at sea without a drop of blood to wet my axe. So spare the chatter, Bakarout, and draw your weapon. Oh! Hey, what? Die! Let's finish them! Kill these heathen bastards! I'm a One guy that's just unwilling to die. Come on. Die. Well, if he's dead. Definitely. Have a look around, all of you. I want no more surprises. Right. I'll check the longhouse. Alright, so judging by what's happening so far, I'm guessing this is where we're going to set up camp. I think this is clear. What do you say, darling? Agreed. All clear. Not a bad fish, though. <laughs> 
vaults know nothing of tending to the weapons. Careless fool. Alright, so let's take a look and see what's in here. Wait! Who are you? Are you with those brigands as well? Sigurd, Zack, in here! Those men had prisoners. Alright, so let me just get these boxes out of the way. Normally, um, when we set up like this, there's always loot, so let's see what I can get. You. Quite bold in those bindings. I like your spirit. We are very agreeable people, I promise. You need not kill us. Peace, friend. We have no need or wish to hurt you. What are your names? Yenli. I'm a merchant, not a bandit like those others. And this is Rowan. Rowan, that's right. I'm a stable hand, that's all. I keep horses, and, well, I did, till those brigands sold them off. They meant to sell us next, as slaves to the nearest bidder. But I read their eyes out before I let that happen. And how did you find yourselves here? We came to trade with the sons of Ragnar, at Halfdan Jarl's asking. But they were gone when we arrived. Unbind them. I sold many a mare and stallion to the brothers. Good men. Always paid me fair. From the look of this camp, they've been gone for some time. Where will you go now? What will you do? Repeat my stocks. Start anew. I have friends and allies across the land to aid me. But it won't be easy. Every town and village needs a stable. To keep horses fit and trim. I'll find my footing again. Somewhere. What are you thinking? That we could use their skills as we get settled. Having access to trade and someone to tend our mounts would be a boon. My thoughts as well. Any friend of the Ragnarsons is a friend of mine. Right, Doug? Whatever you think is best, Sigurd. Janli, Rowan, I am Sigurd Jarl of Fornberg, son of Stilbjörn. This is Eivor and Dag. Both of you are free to go, but more than welcome to stay if you're willing to pull your weight. We'd be happy to, if only to get back on our feet. Then let it be done. The Raven Clan welcomes you. From strangers into friends into family. The others have arrived. Come. I have a good feeling about this place. Oh. Honored family, friends, welcome to your new home. Alright, so this is where it all starts. Everything we've been doing, everything that we're about to do, this is where it starts. Looking good, looking good so far. Fine work. A long house to rival any I've seen. 
Now come. Ranvi has found something I would like you to see. Eivor, Sigurd, I give you England and its four kingdoms. Mercia, East Anglia, Northumbria, and Wessex. From the few plans and maps I discovered here, I believe the sons of Ragnar have pushed further into Mercia, here. My scouts will soon tell me if I am correct. And where are we? Here, in this unnamed copse of trees. Unnamed? We cannot let that stand. What will we call this place? I might have an idea. Ravensthorpe, the village of ravens. Hmm, I like it. The poet in you sings once again. One day this name will be known throughout all of England. A name is only a beginning. If we want renown, we must build, expand. Agreed. We should begin with a forge. Can you help Gunnar get working again? We'll need cargo, supplies. For that our neighbors will provide, whether they wish to or not. Scarcely arrived, and now we must raid. We cannot master this land merely by asking. I'll go and speak with Gunnar now. Good work, my dear. And what else have you found? Short notes, mostly. Scraps of plans, old letters, a few runes to... Alright, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. Once again, thank you so much for watching, thank you for the support, and stick around for the next video coming soon.